Uh, not only is Hokkaido University a renowned institution in Japan, I also, while looking at what courses I would like to take on during my higher education, found myself really attracted by the curriculum of MJSB, and so I decided to study at Hokkaido University. Now that I am in my second year of uh, MJSP program, we are starting to uh, go into more in-depth and specialized subjects. Uh, ones I've really been enjoying specifically are about um, issues relating to Japanese society, as well as my personal interest, which is linguistics and how Japanese linguistics differ from those of other languages. So before actually starting on this program, I was kind of uh, intimidated by the curriculum. I had the impression it was going to be quite uh, strict and we weren't going to perhaps have much freedom about what we studied. However, I was very glad to find that um, as students, we not only get to pick a major and module at the end of our second year, but also before that, we have a lot of choice when it comes to what kind of classes we want to do and what kind of specialties we want to undertake. And I was really happy to see that I could find courses that suited my interests. As for the learning environment at Hokodai, I've been very happy. Uh, I'm in my second year now, which means I've started to write my first project study. And it is definitely a bit of a stressful process. However, I'm very glad that at any point, whenever I have any issue with my project study or with anything related to my academics, it is very easy to contact my supervisor or my other professors. And I found that there is a very nice dynamic and a very nice relationship between the professors and the students, which is not too uh, rigid or severe or strict, but it is actually very close. And I truly feel like I can ask my professors for guidance and help uh, whenever it's needed. I had never come to Sapporo before moving here. I had come to Japan on a trip and I have to say it is definitely very different, but in a good way. Um, as opposed to maybe other big cities in Japan, Sapporo still feels like a big city, but it has the perks of being very close to nature. Uh, the greenery, uh, both on campus and around the city is amazing. And I find that it is a very easy city to live in as opposed to maybe other big crowded cities in the rest of Japan. Specifically, um, although it is in the middle of the city, there is um, a park called Odori Park, and it was very striking to see such a lush green uh, space in the middle of a city. Uh, not only is it beautiful, a lot of events are held there. In the winter, there is the snow festival. In May, there is the lilac festival, as well as many other events. And I think it is a lovely place for everyone in Sapporo, both people who live here and people who are just visiting, to just relax and get together and look at both the greenery and the fountains that are in the park. So Hokkaido University organizes many events, uh, one of which is the Hokudai Sai, which is the university's festival. It happens every year and I think it is a great opportunity to see such like what an amazing environment a Hokudai can foster. Uh, in particular, uh, as a foreign student in Hokkaido University, my favorite part is walking along all the international food stalls that are run by the students themselves. It's really nice to see their collaboration and it's also really nice to try foods and drinks from a lot of different countries. So Hokudai Sai is not only for an event for students, uh, everyone from the city of Sapporo and even outside of Sapporo is welcome to join. And I would really like everyone to come here in June and experience the very nice atmosphere that Hokudai Sai can create on the campus. So right now, during the MDSP courses, I'm focusing a lot on courses that talk about linguistics and language, and that is because uh, in the future, I would like to become a translator, specifically in the specialty of adapting and localizing texts from one language to the other to better suit the audience that they're being watched by. So to any student who is thinking about coming to Hokkaido University, uh, what I would say is don't second guess yourself, believe in your abilities, and uh, there is really nothing to fear about Hokkaido University. It is a rigorous uh, organization, but the other students, the professors and the atmosphere is just so, so good at <clears throat> making you feel included. And I would really recommend for you to come and join us here.
Be ambitious. We're waiting for you here at Hokkaido University. Bye. I decided to go to Hokkaido University. The main reason is they have a good educational resources here. And on the other hand, in Hokkaido University and in Sapporo, you can view the beautiful nature landscape and a beautiful city landscape at the same time, which is very interesting for me. And that's the reason why I chose to study in Hokkaido University. Hello everyone, my name is Xie Wen Kai and I come from China. Now I'm studying in physics department of Integrated Science program. I come to Sapporo as second year student like last year in spring and all my journeys began at that time. I'm studying uh, as the third year student in Integrated Science program. Uh, now I'm just studying the very fundamental physics. But next year, if I come to the fourth year in ISP program, I can choose my own lab, which is very interesting. And I can find my own interesting field and do my further study, like graduate program in the future. My study is very difficult. It's about physics. You need to study very fundamental things after you can go further field. But uh, when I came here, I found that so many professors and senpais is helping me out of this situation. And I feel really lucky for having them here in Hokkaido University. When I was studying here, I feel the free environment, both on the uh, study with professors and uh, communication with my friends. We, on the aspect we study with professors, you can ask questions, I can ask questions every time I want. And professors can answer my questions detailed and help me to improve my scores, improve my knowledge. And for other aspect, uh, I can uh, have so many choices with the uh, laboratories and experimental facilities I can choose for the further study. For the first place that I love in Hukdai University is the central law. Uh, in this lawn, you can be very, very relaxing for every time that you're walking by because we have the river here and listen to the river is always a good way to relax. The river sound is always be beautiful in any seasons. And on the other hand, you can walk in in the central, central lawn and also you can have a picnic in here with your friends. It's all beautiful things to do. For the second place I love is about the General Museum. In the General Museum, you can learn the history of the Hokkaido University. And one of my heroes in Hokkaido University is uh, Suzuki Sang, who won the Nobel Prize. And you can learn uh, about him and uh, visit everything that he used for discover the things when, who, which won the Nobel Prize. And for the third part I love in the university is the gym in the university. The gym is free to every student. It's really nice. It's a way to encourage every student here, including me, to go there and have a better exercises. And in the gym, uh, there has so many equipment that you can use. You can do leg days, uh, chest days, every, every part of your body uh, freely. And uh, yes, uh, to sum up, uh, if you, uh, if uh, I, for the life that I've been studying in Hokkaido University, is good for my body and good for my mind too. For my future study or future path, I want to keep studying physics or keep researching in physics. And maybe uh, if I have a chance, I will join a Japanese uh, company and uh, do my future uh, further study on condensed matter physics. I hope I can find something new, new materials, new things in, in the future, and that can contribute to the human society for a better purpose. If you come to Hokkaido University, you can experience really good lecture, 
and also you can make friends with all the Japanese students. And for the life part, you can experience different view in different seasons, and every season is so beautiful. And for other part, you have the chances to see in the future by your own self, right? I really recommend you to go here, study in Hokdai, and I'm looking forward to see you here in the future. Hokdai is waiting for you, and I am waiting for you too. See you!